Okay, now I'm going to socket together the ear. So the ear would go nicely right here, but I'm going to add a little bit more geometry to do that. Remember, I like I like it when things are four-sided. So the ear should go in somewhere in this area. So I'm going to go to face mode, select these four faces, and extrude in. And we're going to socket in the ear somewhere like that. Do some sculpture so we can blend it in. You can see the shape of the socket. Now you can either extrude the ear or build it out separately. I'm going to choose to build it out separately. I'm going to hold V and snap in a cube right here. I'm going to build it straight. And insert an edge loop. Insert another one here. Okay, and I'm going to pull this ear back. Give it some shape, like so. And it doesn't need to be much more complicated than this. However, it does need four sides, just like this has four sides. So I'm going to get my tool here, my insert edge loop tool. That now I have my four sides I like. And I'm going to take these verts, scale them down. Getting some penetration, so I need to pull it back. You don't want to ever have your model penetrate itself. Okay, now I'm going to go to object mode, and I'm going to hit D and V and move it center point to here, and I'm going to hold the V key, and I'm going to move the ear about where I think it should be on the pig, and rotate it about 45 degrees and figure out how to connect the ear. My shapes are a little different. So what's nice is because it's a socket and it's four sided, I can manipulate it a little bit more. So I'm going to go to vertex mode Pull this down. And we'll have this vertex snap into this one. This will snap into this one, so I'll shape it. Sometimes what you want to do is go to your objects and select um, Edit Mesh and Combine. And you want to work with them together so then I, I can go to vert mode, select these two vertices and hit R, and hitting R I can scale them together like so. Before I go any further, I'm going to want to delete the faces on the interior of the ear and the faces on the interior here of the head where the ear is going to connect. Then I'll select verts again, this one to this one, hit R and scale them together. 
I'm going to leave them a little bit far apart because I still have to merge them. And two more. More than two. Three more. And you can see I've got a decent ear. Can loosen up my geometry a little bit. And that looks like it's just about ready to connect. So now I'll go to the Merge Edge tool and repeat my process using the Merge Edge tool. And I'm pretty close to having a really good looking pig. A little bit more sculpting. 